what is up guys it's so bash welcome back we are back with some more mobile legends and yes i know it has been a while since we have played and looks like they have released some stuff we're not going to go into that we'll just go into it this way hero a lot of new stuff has came out i've not addressed any of it haven't really checked any of it out uh this is actually the first time i'm looking at this hero in the game uh yeah he's a uh, marksman okay but the reason I've kind of not been playing the game is because it's it's gotten stale to me. Um, from time to time, things need to change, and this game has seen very little change. Um, it's been literally eight months since I started playing this game, so it's always been the same stuff in the game. They've not added any new game modes. All they've done is pump out new heroes and skins, which becomes very old if you've been doing this for as long as I have. Now, let's just jump into a matchup, see if we can't actually get a match with this new character. But yeah, this it, it just becomes old and sometimes you need breaks from it. Hopefully they'll eventually change some stuff on it. Uh, I did see they added more uh, servers and stuff like that and this new character animation is not bad I mean overall it looks good to be honest so let's jump into a match all right so uh, begin with I the reason I haven't really posted is like I said it's it's become stale and you kind of need breaks from this sometimes uh, things that have happened since I've last played uh they updated the map uh they added in the new guy uh two characters vexana which i have tested on the advanced server back when she was there being tested and uh my first time playing this guy so he's been released i'm assuming he was released like yesterday or today i haven't really checked any news all right so Go ahead and farm it's 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 really weird playing again and having a farm so is this ultimate what, what is this that's already on, oh that okay that's the transformation so his that's always there yeah, that's that's weird so that's definitely yeah a different type of character not really sure what the difference of the modes are I'm sure one of you could probably tell me. But as for now, we're just going to uh, see what we can do. I've seen that guy go into jungle right here. All right, I see the net. Okay, that's a two shot kind of ability. Regen up. Don't know why you couldn't move and like a lot of people they've been saying they've been having trouble with like uh lag and i know i know i did read that they did add some more servers places uh and normally i would be lagging but currently i'm at 33 ms uh so i know they just added more servers over here and hopefully that fixed a lot of the problems. I know they added servers like a couple updates ago. All right, I'm not quite sure what this guy's really honestly capable of doing. Not much early game, I can tell you that. But yeah, it's just been a culmination of like just really getting tired of the game and, and nothing really changing i mean it's been eight months you play a game the same concept for eight months straight every day it does get tiresome uh other than that i mean i i wish they would try to make some other stuff instead of just milking the community for skins and heroes every other week because i mean I, that to me that's what it's felt like it's done and like the magic will that I, I mean i didn't really speak out uh, uh, against it or say anything about it but yeah it was it was terrible like that 
that's probably one of the worst things they've ever done with this game is that magic wheel it just it shows you they're looking for money that's that that's my opinion to it i mean if you don't believe so i mean you sit there and roll that thing over 200 times and spend a couple hundred dollars on it if you want to just to get a skin but i personally am not going to uh, some of you may have been here since uh, the tai chi panda days and honestly six months after i played that game it got to be like that with that company but to me this this problem here right here people going afk this is another thing that's like pretty much killed me from wanting to play this game which is now that's probably a bot and bots in this game are terrible uh they've not figured out how to code and make ai pro work properly and it's just terrible um I mean, I, and I'm not making this video to bash the company or the game at all. It's just, it's facts. I mean, I'm gonna sit here, I'm gonna tell you the truth, what I think about stuff, regardless. I've always been like that. I'm gonna show you new games. That's why you've been seeing new games on the channel. I've been seeing people ask, you know, why are you showing us games that we can't even play yet or download? Uh, that's the point of what I do. I, with YouTube, there's a lot that a lot of people don't look at um they don't think about they don't know about because they don't do it and if you don't do it it's it's going to be obvious that you don't know what you're talking about because you don't know how much work actually goes into the stuff that is done here yeah this, this guy is not working out too well against the current meta anyway it's it's all the back-end work that nobody knows about people think we just play these games cut it up and post videos there's tons more behind the scenes that has to be done for you to actually stay relevant grow and even just be able to be successful in terms of having a channel that you know people constantly come to on a daily basis and watch videos regardless of if, if it's what you're posting now or if it's what you pre previously posted and SEO'd so I mean a lot of you probably won't understand that aspect of YouTube and why we do some of the stuff we do, but it's just the same thing I've always done. I've always played these games. I've always done guides, tips, tricks, things like that. And it's, it's, it, it gets old doing it with the same game, especially when everybody does the same exact type of videos. There's no originality to this community anymore. Uh, if somebody sees something that is, they think it's cool, they just take it and they just, they do it. Uh, and usually that winds up being larger YouTubers that have more subscribers and viewers that take this and they profit from it. See, I'm just stuck under your own tower. That's dumb. That's, that's another reason I've really not wanted to play this game is the meta the meta currently is so dumb in this game it's not original it's all revolves around a stun a transformation or a slow and all you have to do is pick a meta that has those stuns and your comp wins and as far as competitive wise this game to me will never be highly competitive for esports because of the fact of the balancing of it uh, they won't listen to the community for what actually works right and is what's messed up. Like, look here, the map is even glitching out. So, I mean, it's just small things that they don't look at, they don't listen to from the community that really needs to be addressed. And it just gets overlooked and it's like they don't care. So, I mean, if they don't care, why should I? So that that's, I, I've tried conveying that message to them like i've i've put in a lot of work for this game uh regardless if anybody knows it or not i've helped a lot of people in the community uh just about every youtuber in this community has came to me and asked me for help at a certain point to do a certain thing so it's 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 funny when people say oh this person's better than this other person and nothing ever gets conveyed like oh yeah well this person doesn't know about this only because so and so told them yeah well I i'm that person that just never gets the credit and I honestly i don't care it doesn't bother me i'm here for the community to help the community the same thing i've been doing since i've been here and i'm not going to change doing that so 
I'll continue to play the games and I'll continue playing other games as well. So, I mean, I've never been a strictly Mobile Legends channel. If you're new here and you thought it was nothing but Mobile Legends, uh, we've made a lot of Mobile Legends content. I've made over 100 videos for this game, uh, made trailers, promos, stuff like that. Stuff that was supposed to be used as advertisements and it was never used. Uh, and it's that's why I really, I don't really want to talk to the devs anymore. Uh, pretty much whatever you say they'll contradict and it's it's just not I don't know it's not a fun interaction to work with the developers of this game uh, every interaction has been pretty terrible in my experience and as far as what they do they are basically pitting the youtubers against each other that's what they're trying to do and the way they have it set up is they can get information to the exact person they want to which is blue panda that's where all the information gets leaked to first and everybody knows that uh but nobody says anything about it and i honestly don't care to i it's there's no point in doing or saying anything about it because it's just gonna get brushed off like oh this smaller youtuber is attacking this person for this reason no i'm just here to tell you the truth like i always have I share what i share and if people don't like it they don't have to stay here like you you guys know what i do how long i've been doing it and if you're new here and you haven't just take a look back at the channel uh i've been doing this for over two years i'm not going anywhere uh regardless of what anybody thinks they can do or change it's not going to i really wish i knew exactly what his ultimate is i could probably read it if i would know but overall, the game just needs more diversity. That's, that's what I'm saying. And there's other games a lot of a lot of you already know that are going to be coming out soon, which is, of course, uh, Strike of Kings. And you might not want to admit it, but that game is going to put a heavy hurting on this game. Like, people don't realize how much that game is going to make a difference on this game. When Tencent releases that, it's going to be huge. All right, so we actually got a kill right there with his ultimate mode. So let's stay in it. I don't know what this other ability it does. Let's see if we can't catch somebody slipping. This Roger up here. All right, they, there he is. Moscow went up there after him. See, I'm not used to this new jungle. But, yeah, regardless, I mean, like I said, I didn't make this video to rant or complain or anything like that. It's just, I've had a lot of people asking me, where's the ML videos? Why ain't you been posting and stuff like that? And it's, I haven't had fun with the game. I, I'm just, I'm being honest. This guy has a very short range, so somebody could easily jump into the bush and pick you off. But yeah, it's it's a game that I will continue to play regardless if I'm like recording it daily. I mean, I'm still going to play it. I may not play it as much, but like you just have to look at the amount of these other games that are going to be coming out soon. And how many of these other games are already better? Are you know prepared to do what they need to do to be relevant in the certain scene like we already know Tencent is going to be going for esports we already know that they've built a multi-billion dollar esports scene in China uh, if you didn't know that uh, keep up with that a lot of stuff that on Twitter I retweet a lot of that stuff so if you're interested in keeping up with like business aspects of some of these companies and how they do you can follow me on uh, Twitter. I'll talk about a lot of that stuff on there. Uh, let's see. Maya is way overextended. Or that was just a trap. Yep, that was just a trap. Anyway, it's kind of hard to concentrate while talking and doing that at the same time. But that's Roger. If I wanted to get some good gameplay out, I would actually sit down and play him. That's the very first time I ever played him. But the main reason I wanted to make the video was because a lot of people were asking, you know, where's the Mobile Legends content? What's going on? And it's, it's, 
it's hard to convey this message to people and let them understand or get them to understand how you feel about what you've done over years of being in a community and and I this I don't know the, the game just needs to change like there needs to be some type of diversity to the what you can do with it this the same old gets very old uh, they don't do tournaments on a weekly basis that are actually interesting uh, the what is it national arena that stuff is very boring I've never watched a full solid match of that and been interested in it because it doesn't get shout casted and if it does get shout casted it gets shout casted by someone that you can't understand what they're saying and that's just the gist of it it's not going to be a game that's ever pushed in the western market solidly because this game is ran by a company in china so you're pretty much looking where this is going to be promoted is the southeast asia area heavily uh that's just that's how it is and you've got strike of kings coming in in a couple months guys it's pretty much gonna take over the western market over it uh if you don't like that saying i'm sorry it's just my honest opinion what i think is gonna happen uh tencent knows what they're doing moon tune has no clue what they're doing and it's just gonna be a win-win for them i mean it's they they've already came in and spent millions building an audience all tencent has to do is come in and advertise and that's exactly what they're gonna do They've already talked about esports. I mean, they've got companies in the United States working with influencers to bring content for the game. They're doing everything that Moontoon can't do because they don't know how to do it. They won't listen. And yeah, I mean, stick around. We're going to have more content. But I mean, I felt like I just needed to make a video. I know this has been a long video, kind of a Ranny style video with shitty gameplay. And the. Uh, I, my intention was not to bring you good gameplay. It's the first time I ever played Roger, and it is what it is. False perception. That's what a lot of people in this community have, and I'm going to end it on that. If you have any questions, guys, feel free to leave them in the comments below. I'll get to them. I promise you I will. I see everything that comes through. And, yeah, that's going to be it, guys. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.